Hello everyone, this is Pop Part C here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to get redstone on iOS right now for Minecraft Pocket Edition 0.12.0 along with the 0.1 and 0.2 update. So what you're going to need is you're going to need to have your device jailbroken, and you're going to open up Cydia. Now once you've got that opened up, go ahead and go to Sources. Now you're going to tap the Edit button on the top right, and click the Add button on the top left. Now what you're going to type is cydia.myrepospace.com slash byte and a half. Now once you've done that, go ahead and hit the Add Source button. Now it's going to go ahead and add that source up for you. And what that does is it basically gives you access to the actual redstone files that byte and a half has created for iOS devices. So go ahead and return to Cydia. Now what you're going to do is you're going to click done. Now select the Cydia byte and a half my repo space and do all packages and tap on pocket power. Click install, confirm and it should install without any problems on your iOS device. Now once that's done, go ahead and restart your springboard. All right, now once your device comes back on, go ahead and open up Minecraft Pocket Edition and I'm going to play and do a new world in creative just to show you guys that the redstone stuff is actually there, all the redstone items and everything. Ooh, this is kind of a cool place, got some snow. All right, so now I'm going to go to your inventory here. You're going to click on the seeds tab. Now I'm going to grab myself some redstone, some redstone repeaters, some redstone torches, pressure plates, and we'll go ahead and place a few of those down so you can see they actually do work. So redstone, I'm going to clear up a couple of grass spots and place some so you can see the redstone does place on the ground exactly how you would I expect it on the PC version. So I'm going to place a redstone torch. You'll see that it does power the redstone here. So I'm going to place another strip of uh, redstone right there. Okay, and you can see the difference. This one's obviously darker because energy is not actually flowing in this strip over here because we have not given it a power source like this torch over there, which is powering this strip. Now, we've also got repeaters, of course. Now, repeaters repeat the signal and keep it strong so that you can make the strip go very, very far, of course, because otherwise you'll find that the signal does not live as long. So I'll show you guys the example. If you break this repeater, you'll see the signal gets really weak down there, right? It's getting very dark. So... You repeat the signal right about there, and boom, you've got your signal going very strong, nice across the whole thing. Now, another thing you can do is use a pressure plate, and you can step on it to create power for your redstone. So, of course, many methods exist, and there's also levers and things like that that have been implemented by Byte and a Half to make sure you've got plenty of ways to do this. Anyway, that's how you install Redstone in Minecraft Pocket Edition for iOS. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed today's video. I'll also be making some showcases and tutorials on how to use Redstone on the channel. So be sure to subscribe and check those out in the coming days as I publish those. Thanks again, guys, and I'll see you next time in more Minecraft Pocket Edition.